Hey guys, welcome back to a quick Sabre plugin tip. Now, Dylan Hansen asks, how would you change the text that the Sabre follows if you want to change it after finishing this tutorial? So one of my previous tutorials, I went over Sabre and how to do some cool Star Wars looking effects and it was through making mask. So you ended up with something like this with mask. It's based on the mask outlines. These things are so like the mask is made from text and once you do that it's kind of stuck that way how would you change it so there's a couple different ways to use saber and my method before was using using layer mask but there's a different way of doing it that is really awesome so once you do like a new solid um, with saber so right click new solid to get your effects and presets click saber drag your saber onto your solid inside of after effects and you choose you know, your preset, whatever you want, doesn't matter. What you're gonna do is just type some text. So grab the text tool, type Saber Made Easy. I don't know, something like that, doesn't matter. Normally you could take this, right click, effect, or you know, create mask from text, which you would do your mask. And then you could take, take your Saber effect and paste it on there. And you would want to go to customize core layer masks and kind of like that you know saber made easy change it to firestorm or whatever but th this offers a lot of different advantages of doing it through masks obviously but there's another way of doing it that is really simple and easy so let's delete this mask turn our text back on take the black solid put it on top of the text and we'll go to our customized core change it to text layer and then click Saber made easy. So we can turn the text layer off. Let's change this to an effect we can see, like neon. Pretty sure there's one. Yeah, neon. Turn the glow down. And boom. It's pulling from the text for our Saber plugin. So what we could really easily do is just double click the text and type something new. So I let's do Dylan Hansen on YouTube asked for this method. So that's how you do it. It's really easy. Just set your uh, customized core to text layer and choose your text. So if you had new, you know, different text on the screen, you can do Maxwell and quickly change it to Maxwell. Now it's that. You turn your text off and go from there. And also did this and if you even, you know, increase this Increase the size, just like that. And you can go from there and start doing all your effects with Saber. So that's about it. Um, remember, customize core, choose your text layer. Very, very simple. I hope this helps. So thanks, Dylan, for asking the question. I hope this helps. And to anyone else with questions, please leave a comment below. Challenge me. I'll see if I can uh, figure out something cool for you. Other than that, thanks, guys. Please like and subscribe. And I'll catch you next time. Peace.